everybody, it's Christina. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to do a really, really interesting video that I don't think I've ever done on here before. And it is a real versus fake. And then I'm going to do swatches because I have three of the real products and one fake. So then we're going to do swatches and then I will do lip swatches. And then I'm going to share kind of a, like a first impression sort of because I haven't used, um, I've only used one of these colors one time. And the other two are the other two real ones I haven't used yet but so I wanted to kind of share this with you guys and then I will come back on another day and share uh, my further thoughts on it um, the first thing I do want to say though is this is a video that I'm doing about the products if you don't like the company or the person behind the company um, that's fine that's your opinion um, I don't, I'm not going to, you know, share an opinion about it, but, um, I'm just going based off of the products. So, um, if you feel like you have to share the hate down below in the comments, please don't. My channel is a very positive channel. Um, you can see the title and I just told you what this video is going to be about. So if you don't like the brand, definitely you don't have to watch it. So, but. If you guys are interested in seeing this, go ahead and keep watching. So today I'm doing a video on the Jeffree Star lip, lip products. And um, I have always wanted to try these. So I actually got approved to try a fake up one off of Amazon when I was a reviewer. They actually stopped their reviewing pro privacy or their reviewing on Amazon mostly. Um, so I just don't do that anymore, but I did win a Jeffree Star lipstick in another giveaway, a real one, and then I got two real ones from the summer collection in a swap. So first thing I'm going to do is do the real versus fake. So let's go ahead and get into that. Okay, this is the fake right here, and this one is the real. And this wasn't ripped when I got it, but um, I got excited and I went to try to open it. And I am like kind of a, I kind of stink at getting these things open sometimes. So, um, the first thing that we can uh, noticeably see is that the lettering on the real one is in like a pink. And the stars are rose gold. And this one, the lettering is in white and it's a bigger and it's a different font it looks like. I will insert pictures of this too. Um, and then the gold, the stars are gold on the fake one. Okay, so then we go to the top and the actual names for these, they're on different, but <laughs> this is the real one. This is the Scorpio. And yeah, these aren't the same color either. I just wanted to compare kind of like the packaging so you guys could see. And then the fake is a different um, lettering. It's a different color. That's not even the color that was that is going to be in there. And um, it's just different because of they're supposed to look like this. The let's see. The side says the same stuff, but it's in different. A different font and a different color the fake one is in white and the real one is in a light pink font and they all they both say the same thing they say you know to exfoliate with lip scrub before use avoid food with oil and no making out kisses are okay smile ready for your close-up long-lasting extreme beauty matte finish cruelty free and vegan so and on the fake one, they're all kind of mushed together. Then on the other side, they have the ingredients, which I cannot read because on the fake, they put a sticker. So that's a good indicator when you buy them and there's a big old sticker on there. <laughs> but the lettering is the same. It's a different font. It's in white and, you know, it just is obvious on that part. Okay, and then the last part is the back. You can just see how the barcode is bigger 
it has the name with the color that's on the top here. So it's Scorpio in the purpley color that's on top here. This just says Unicorn Blood and it's written in black. Which is a bigger sticker and then that sticker that they put on there is all the way back on here. So that is that. Let's go ahead and get the lipsticks out. And we will go on that. Oh, and then on the inside, the fake one is like a orangey corally color, and the real one is a light pink. I didn't even notice that the first time, so now we see. Okay. So when you get like to pass the boxes, they actually look really, really similar now. And I'm glad I didn't get the same colors because, well, I made sure the colors would have been off. But um, these are pretty, pretty good. This is the the realest looking fake that I've ever seen package wise because that looks pretty good. Looking close up, they look they look pretty identical, but these stars look a little the on the root the stars on the fake look kind of like a little bit fuzzier than the real stars. Do you see what I'm saying? These are more, these are way more clear. And they actually, this one does not feel like it has a locking cap like this one, but it is a nice cap. Okay. The lettering looks pretty, pretty realistic on this. Like I said, I'll do, try to do pictures of as much of the stuff as I can. Um, and this sticker on the bottom of this is the closest looking to like a real one ever because normally it just says like a, it's just a sticker with a name. But this actually says Unicorn Blood and it says Jeffrey Cosmetics just like this one. But the font is different and this one is smaller and it has a serial number stamped on it and this one does, the fake one does not. Then we're going to go into the applicator. This is this one. And this is this one. So his real applicators actually have clear up in the top. Clear right here. And it's got this doe foot applicator like this. And this is white on the inside. White on here. And it looks like this. Totally different, right? Um, I will try to insert a picture of a swatch of the real unicorn blood. But, um, yeah, I don't have that one. And But I do have these two. And they are from the Summer Collection. And they are Queen Bee. And they, too, have the, um, what do you call it? the stamps on the bottom, the serial stamps. So I figured let's go ahead and swatch them all first and then we'll do lip swatches. So let's start with the, let's just start with the fake. Why not? It smells like, uh, it's weird, it's kind of like a chocolatey but it's kind of like bologna, I don't know, it's our hot dog, something really weird that I don't like, so. But that is what it looks like when I first do a swipe, let it dry down. This one doesn't smell like anything to me. But the formula is like already completely different. It just, the way it feels is just completely different. This one has that like watermelon scent. It's a little powerful. And this one was the Virginity. I don't know if I told you what that color name. And then the last one is this one right here. Yeah, this one has that same smell.
and this one looks like it's going to be patchy as heck. But um, Jeffree Star's um, makeup is actually eye safe and it's vegan and cruelty free, I do believe. So, yeah. I would definitely check that out if you're interested in that information, but I'm pretty sure I'm right on all that. So, I would definitely, even though I can't use these on my lips as often, I could use this with a liner brush and completely do like a colored liner. So, that's kind of why I got these two. Not because I just wanted to try them, but I wanted some of the summer collection and I figured I could use it for many different things. So, I'm going to let these dry down and then I'll show you guys a picture or I'll show you guys a picture of it. So after I filmed that part of the video, my sister and her boyfriend and my nephew showed up. So uh, my sister helped me to dye my hair um, and then I dyed it this color the next day because um, we got it lightened up enough to where I wanted it. So anyways, um, that's why I have a new color. Um, I already did the hand swatches and the picture for that for you guys. So now we're going to get into the lip swatches. I'm going to start with the fake and then I'm going to do this color and then I'm going to do the yellow. And then I'm going to end with this color and then I will give you guys like a quick little mini review of what I think and we'll, we'll close out the video. So if you guys want to see these lip swatches of these lippies, please keep watching.
Okay, so now let's go over the colors. Okay, first of all, this one looked really good. I like the way it looked, and it wasn't like super, super drying on my lips, but it smells absolutely horrible. It smells so disgusting that I almost threw up. So, this is going straight in the trash. I just got this to try to compare for you guys, but I mean, this is, I thought this was an amazing fake, but it smells absolutely disgusting. It makes me want to throw up. So, that sucked. <laughs> The next one is this color, and I really, really love the way this color looks on me. It's way darker than it is in here because it looks like a like a darker purple, but it looks more like a like a grayish purple that's darker on my lips. I really, really like this one, and this one doesn't have any scent to me at all. And I noticed that with all these, maybe I'm not letting them dry soon enough, or maybe I need to set them with powder. But um, I mean, none of these were sticky to me at all, but. Some of these were like, they had a lot of transfer at first, but then once at the first initial kiss, they didn't do that after that. So maybe I'm just not letting them dry enough. But that's the, just the problem that I've had with them so far. But other than that, you know, they'll last a long time and it looks good. They just kind of, the wear is going to come down if I don't let it dry. So I'm going to try letting these dry um, next time, but that's that one. Um, this one... I thought it looked really cool, but I'm probably going to use it for like liner or something because it was kind of streaky a little bit. And I don't know if I need to pile more on or because I know you can't layer them, I don't think. And it was kind of flaking off in the middle and it kind of started to flake off and it was kind of showing through my lips. I mean, this one kind of is too, but not, not as bad as this one was. This one was really kind of patchy on. This one I think looks absolutely beautiful. Like I really really love these two I think they look really great but it's not super drying it's not sticky you can tell that my lips you can look and tell that they're a little bit dry but it's not super drying um the one lipstick and liquid lipstick that I do not like the most is the Ofra lipstick liquid lipsticks I think they are super drying and I don't like them at all I don't like them at all <laughs> so that's just me that's just my opinion so um Take this out real quick. I'm trying to show you guys. I think this is really pretty, and I think I could probably layer some um, lip gloss on top of these, and they would look even prettier too. Um, but I just wanted to give a shout out to my friend that sent me this, Kayla Allure. I won this and I won her giveaways. This is amazing. This is going to be a lifesaver for my dry lips. This was really great. Um, so if you guys haven't checked this out, this is by the company Fresh, and it's called the Sugar Lip Polish. Um, I'm not sure if it has a kind or anything, but it came in this right here. I finally got a chance to open it and use it, so yay. Um, but um, so far, I think they're really good lipsticks. I'm, I'm really impressed with the quality of the, the real ones. <laughs> the fake one was cheap, and it, it, it smells horrible. I wish it didn't smell horrible because it actually, I like the color on it. I really did, um, and I like the packaging. I think it looked really pretty close to the real thing. Um, but, um, I really like it so far. I will definitely give you guys an update later on, you know, if you guys are interested. And I will start wearing these colors more in videos so you guys can see how they wear. Um, I might just do a video where I wear one of the colors that I really, really love. One of these, um, throughout like a whole day and show you like how they wear off. And then I'm definitely going to use this to play with some different liner looks, stuff like that. Um, or unless I can get it to look really good. I don't know. We'll see. But, um, that's my little mini review, kind of first impression, sort of, because I've only worn this one one another time in that, um, pixie video, so if you guys saw that and you liked the way it looked, that was, um, uh, for me wearing it for a little bit, not, not a whole long, a whole lot, but, um, this one's really, really comfortable to wear. I really like this one, and it smells so good. It smells like watermelon or whatever the summer flavor was. I think it's watermelon, but, yeah, these two smell like watermelon, and they smell so good. I know they're a little worn down, but um, that's that's not from being fake or anything. That's just from being stored. <laughs> they just wore. Um, and then this one I just got in a giveaway, and I absolutely love this color. So thank you so much, White Latifah's Wisdom. I love you. Um, so I will link the channels down below that I mentioned. If you guys liked this video, um, definitely give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel so you can check out future videos. Um, definitely hit that little bell if you want to be notified of all my future videos. And then comment down below. Let me know what you thought was your favorite color. Um, the fake one was called Unicorn Blood. 
the real one right here, this color right here was called Scorpio. I'm sure you guys saw. Um, this one right here was called Queen Bee, the yellow. And then the last one is called Virginity. So if you guys want to see me create a, another look or something based around one of these lipsticks or anything you guys want to say, say hi. Let me know which color is your favorite, which color you wish you had of the new stuff that just released. Oh goodness, <laughs> there's so many that I want. I should I wish I could have got the lip impunitions because they were like ten dollars on um, Cyber Monday and Black Friday, I think, and there was free shipping. And oh my gosh, um, but um, definitely let me know what you guys think, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.